You know, this is where Juju says he likes to fight that Mexican style, always punching, living up to that. And that's what you love to see as a, as a boxing fan. Yeah, you see the hands are very low on Para. Ramos taking advantage of that. Very early in the fight to have the, the hands so low. As well, the fans, I've got to call it, I think they're here for Juju. They seem to be really supporting their guy. He came strong with a crew today. Yeah, you see, it's always telling when one of them is sitting and the other fighter standing. And I don't think that's showmanship. I think that I think that Juju's ready to go. I think yeah. Juju's ready for this this next round to start. I think Para, he's he's breathing as much as he can right now. Well, that's something that happens a lot with influencer fight league. You see that difference between the people who are here to influence and the people that are here to fight. And I think we're starting to see a lot of that with uh, Ramos just coming out strong right out of the gate in round two. Maybe the mind games are what he's trying to lean on here, trying to do something different because he just is getting a beating in there. If, if Perra doesn't come in with something big, doesn't hit a big shot soon, then he's going to be in trouble come round three. You can't leave your hands down that much and not expect to get caught in the face once or twice. And it looks like Ramos got what he was looking for. Looking confident with a big smile, looking to the crowd, the crowd cheering back, and you can see the body language in oh, both yeah. corners right now. But Para, again, you got to give him credit for hanging in there, and I have to wonder what his coaches are telling him right now. Are they telling him you got to go for a knockout, you got to go for something big? I have to imagine the rounds are against him right now. Ramos, with some quick moves of his own, really looks like he was ready for the barrage. And he's taking it, but Para not going down without a fight. Wants to make sure if he can't go home with a win tonight, he at least wants to go home proud of what he did. Exactly. And he's, he's coming in swinging, and you got to love seeing that. The crowd just as relentless as Ramos seems to be. Ramos could take it easy. Ramos could lay back knowing he's got the first two rounds, but not, not happy with that. Ramos is fighting like he wants a knockout. I mean, he told us he's always punching, and that is literally what he's doing. I don't know if I've seen him stop this entire round. 